John Barnett here with Imaging Resource. We're going to talk with Peter Seitz, who's going to tell us about a pretty amazing new camera. Yeah, so we're making a special camera for photographers who make uh, wide uh, pictures, wide angle pictures, and this uh, 6 by 17. So it's a sensor is 6 cm high, and the, uh, the film length uh, and the length is 17 cm. And we make uh, the photo will be 160 megapixel. But this doesn't have a traditional shutter. This has a different kind of mechanism. Can you tell me about that? Yeah, it's different. It's not a one shot. So it's uh, inside. It's, uh, it's a sensor. It's moving from one side to the other. And it makes this in one second. This 160 megapixel. So it scans across a, a, an o a slit opening and the sensor... Yes, the sensor is moving from this side. Uh, lens is open and then it, it, it moves to the other side in a, in, a, in a linear scanning. Which explains why it's so wide. It's, a, it's twice as much as 17 centimeters. So there is uh, some cameras existent with film in 17 centimeter and we are doing this in digital in the highest quality what is possible. All right, well, and what kind of a lens does it have on this thing? So this lens here is uh, 72 millimeter and we have an angle of 150 degree. It's a very wide angle, so we, so the image uh, at, the, at the end is uh, 920 megabytes. <laughs> so that will not fit. That will fit one image on my one gigabyte card. On your gigabyte card, we can fit one picture. So you have an alternate storage method. Yes. So we have a, we have a hard disk with a 250 gigabyte, and then we can storage store a lot of pictures. And uh, how much is this going to be running people when they buy? The what you mean? Uh, the cost? Of, yeah. uh, the cost is about twenty-seven thousand euro. And, and your major customer on this is landscape photographers. Major customer is landscape photographers and also uh, people who make uh, houses and architectures, architecture. Excellent. Well, thanks very much, Peter. I appreciate it. Yes. Thank you, Sean.